Ding, ding, ding. I've got another bonus for you because this has been so dramatic in my life. The a fourth guiding principle is commit to sit for one minute at some point in your day. There is a story about a math teacher, a high school math teacher on the East Coast who started his classes with sitting quietly for one minute. He didn't call it meditation. He didn't give them any explicit instructions except that you couldn't bother anybody else. Just sit quietly. And he set a timer. And when the timer went off, they did math. Teachers, other teachers started to notice that the kids who came from his class tended to be more cooperative, more ready to work, um, more engaging. And so they asked him what he did and he told them. And they started to start their classes with sitting quietly for one minute. Pretty soon, much of the school was starting each class with one minute of sitting quietly. And guess what happened? Truancy went down, grades went up, test scores went up, tardies and absences went down. There was an overall sense of happiness that increased. One minute of silence. I know that you can do one minute of sitting still, sitting in quiet at some point in your day. Please don't put it on your to-do list. Let it happen when it feels like a good moment to you in your morning, afternoon, or evening. Sitting in the car, waiting for your kids after school, set a timer on your phone for a minute. Close your eyes and sit quietly for a minute. Before bed, maybe before you turn your light off, maybe after, sit quietly, set a timer for one minute. You'll be amazed. You'll